What is good, Guardians? Welcome to another Destiny 2 video from Ultimate Casual Gaming, the home for the casual gamer. I'm just flexing. And in today's video, we're going to talk about Destiny 2 and the weekly reset. And for all my newbies out there, especially the filthy casuals, the weekly reset is where the primary in-game activities reset to give you a chance to earn high-level rewards on each of your characters. But those of you that have multiple characters at this point. Activities such as the Nightfall, the Raid, Flashpoint Location, Weekly Crucible, and Clan XP will all reset. Of course, if you find the content of today's video helpful, please feel free to click the like button. Now let's go ahead and get into the video. The first thing you'll want to do is pull up the directory and then pull up your menu on the left. Now when you do that, you'll immediately notice the milestones that are listed at the top you'll see your reputation challenge the daily challenges um, that are listed but more importantly you'll see things like your flashpoint which this week is on Nessus last week if you remember it was on the European dead zone so all you have to do is go here and complete public events your nightfall is also reset we'll talk about that in a second call to arms is your weekly crucible milestone and all you have to do here is go into the crucible and win some and not even win some matches just participate in some matches um, I think winning helps advance this a little faster but I'm not sure but I do know that you don't necessarily need to win in order to earn this uh, weekly milestone so just get in there and you'll see the percentage start going up and of course clan XP this is where you can earn XP for your clan up to 5,000 XP um, by doing things like strikes and raids and crucible and other types of activities like patrols on planets and um, you can earn 5,000 XP per character again for those of you who have multiple characters so this is an opportunity to again continue to climb the ladder with your clan now for the nightfall if we go over to the strikes and we click on we can see that the nightfall this week is the inverted spire and what's interesting about the inverted spire Bungie had mentioned that the modifiers for this week would pretty much be the same and they're close but they're not exactly the same prism is back that was there last week for those that didn't try the nightfall out prism is essentially where you, the elemental damage is rotated every I believe 30 seconds and during that phase that element deals increased damage uh, however all your other um, elemental types are reduced in damage as well as kinetic oh, well kinetic actually isn't affected so kinetic stays the same but um, all the other elemental damages uh, will have less effect and this will rotate like I said every 30 seconds so that's back what's new is time warp which <coughs> is particular to the Vex. And we can see that in order to earn additional time uh, for the strike, you, you have to go through the Vex gates. And for those that had a chance to play the Inverted Spire during the beta, you know that there were a number of these gates throughout the strike. So uh, I think this is great. Hopefully they'll add some more because I'm not sure if there's enough at this point for us to keep time on the clock like we did with killing enemies so this should be interesting the other thing to mention is clan rewards as i mentioned you have a chance this week to earn an increase clan rewards for your clan and as you can see at our clan we're at one this week but we should be able to get to two this week and my weekly um, contribution as I said it's capped at five but I'll, it's reset now so I get a chance to do that again by per character as well your weekly clan Ingrams also reset so you have to jump in there with at least one other uh, crucible uh, clan partner sorry in order to earn the crucible Ingram and similarly with Nightfall you need at least one other clan mate and with the raid you'll need at least three clan mates well you'll need yourself and two other clan mates to make up your raid team in order to get the weekly Ingram uh, trials of the nine at least one other clan mate so all these things will be eligible this week for weekly clan Ingrams for everyone in your clan which is fantastic so a lot a lot this week in order for us to earn additional rewards to level up our characters so with that 
I hope you enjoyed the video and certainly appreciate you watching. We plan to bring these weekly reset videos every week to give you an idea of what the reset items are in terms of things like the nightfall. If there are challenge modes start, that get introduced to the raid, we'll also talk about those as well. Um, if you did enjoy the content, again, a like is certainly appreciated and helps us out. Of course, if you want more content on Destiny 2 and other great games, remember to hit the subscribe button and click on the bell next to it to get notifications when we post new videos. That's all for now. A sincere thanks to all the gamers out there, both casual and hardcore. Let's go and get our game on.